Hello and welcome. This is part of a series. I sure hope that you check out the full playlist. There should be a link in the description or at the end of this video. And not only this playlist, but I have hundreds of shell scripts tutorials. Just check my website, filmsbychris.com. That's Chris the K. There's a link in the description. Today we're going to be looking at the help command. A lot of you may be familiar with the man uh, command, which is the manual command. If not, you really should. You're probably looking up stuff online, don't need to. For those of you who are unfamiliar, uh, most programs in the shell, you can type in man, and I'll give you an example, we'll do nmap, and it will give you a manual on how to use that program. And a good man page will have examples as well, as I just talked about in previous videos. So lots of options here in the nmap uh, man page. But what happens when you do something like, I don't know, have a command like um, type? which we talked about in the previous video. We also talked about the command command. Let's go ahead and type in man command. Oh, no manual entry. What if I type in man type? Well, there is, but it's not the command we're looking for. Uh, these are built-in functions into the shell, and although there might be notes on it, if you were to, um, like man bash, if you're in a bash shell, which is a very long man page because there's lots of commands built in and there might be some information in there on these commands since they're built in commands, but it's a long man page and yes, you can search through it, but there's an easier way. Uh, the help command, the help command, so we can type in help and type and I get an error here and that's because help is not built into Z shell, which I'm currently using here. So, but if you're running bash, I can type in help and I can type in the type command. And here we go. I get a little help uh, display here. Basically just, just like a quick little man page. Um, you know, some programs have this built in. You type in the command and help. But in this case, I have the help command and I can also do command and I get the command uh, help page. So remember when you're working with different shells, not everything might be there. Built-in functions might be different. And if I command help, oh, sorry, command dash V help. Let's see what happens here. It tells me it's a built, it's built into the shell. Uh, if I exit back out here, what happens if I do command dash V here? I'm curious. I haven't tried this yet. See, it's not found because it's built into bash. It's not built into Z shell. There might be something similar in Z shell that I'm familiar, unfamiliar with. Uh, so that's important to know. So, so now we've looked at using the type and command command to, um, to see where programs are and we can find out which ones are built into the shell and which one are external programs. And if it's built in and there's no man page, sometimes there is, sometimes they're not. Um, but the help command will help you, but only if it's built into your shell. So, uh, again, if you're in bash, help and the name of the command, such as command, and you'll get the help page. Uh, so that's it for this tutorial. Uh, I do hope that you're enjoying it. It was a quick one. Uh, and yeah, I love Z shell, and, but I also love bash. And it's a shame there's no, the help command isn't built in, but again, there might be something else I'm unaware of. If there is, let me know in the comments. If you like my videos, you like these shell script tutorials, be sure to keep on watching. Subscribe so you don't miss any. There's a full playlist in the link of the, in the description of this video, hopefully at the end of this video as well, if I don't forget to put it there. Uh, and again, I have hundreds and hundreds of shell script videos in the past. Check out my website, filmsbychris.com. That's Chris the K. There's a link in the description there. You can search through all my videos from both my channels. And also think about supporting over at patreon.com forward slash mailx1000 or with PayPal. You can find that in the support section on my website. If you can't support me that way, it really does help if you share these videos, like these videos, watch these videos. And uh, I'm not going to lie, I use ad blockers, but uh, if you could turn them off while you're watching my videos, that would help out too. I do thanks for watching. And uh, as always, I hope that you have a great day.